p-value of t-test, without software. Step-by-step -step guide. MS Excel formulas of p-value, t-test, versus, z-test. The example of t-test is given by putting values in mathematical formula of t-test we get value of t-test is equal to 2.1875. We compare both MS Excel formulas of calculating p-value of t-test and z-test, but keep in mind I used t-test value of 2.1875 with normal distribution as well by using negative and positive cumulative area under standard normal curve. In order check differences in p-values based on my own knowledge and experience. So p-value of t-test is 0 0.3870 for two tails while p-value of z-test is 0 0.02870 for two tails. Differences of MS Excel formulas of t-test and z-test by using t-test value of 2.1875. Thus the one tail test difference of p-value is 0 0.0050 while two tail test difference of p-value is 0 0.100. When comparing one test statistics with same value with own and different statistical tables. It is important tip that is the difference of 0.0050 in one tail test is because of Z distribution can't use degree of freedom which is N-1. Calculate p-value of Z test manually from table. T test value is 2.1875 or 2.19. It is important tip of get p-value of Z test from Z table then we will add 0 0.0050 to get one tail t test p value and then multiply by 2 gives two tail test p value of t test which will exact equal to ms excel values because in exam you are not allowed to use ms excel software or p value calculator to find it the probability of 2.19 is 0 0.9857 by subtracting from 1 gives 0 0.0143 for one tail test p-value of z-test. After that probability of test is multiply by 2 to get 0 0.0286 which is p-value of z-test for two tail test by using t-test value of 2.1875. After adding 0.0050 in one tail probability of Z test give T test one side probability of 0.0134 same as MS Excel results. After that multiply by 2 with T test one side probability of 0.0134 gives 0.03868 probability value of T test for two tail. Here in this Z table how you can select probability value of 2.19 in table, which is 0 0.9857. Formula of P value, using T distribution table. Subtracting X from alpha 1 is P value for one tail test. For solving X, we can find one side P value of T test after that multiply by 2 to get two side P value of T test. For that purpose, we will select two T test values in which calculated T test falls between them and two significance levels. The formula of X is also given in equation 2 in which we know alpha 1, alpha 2, T test lower, t-test higher and t-test calculated. For solving x, we get, x is equal to 0.04328 Thus, one side p-value of t-test is equal to 0.0207 and two side of p-value of t-test is equal to 0.0414. So, in the above equation 1, you can also do reverse calculations because we know alpha 1 value, p value from z table to compute p value of t test. So, 
easily get x in equation 1 and then find either upper or lower t test value in equation 2. How to select two values of t test in which calculated t test values falls between them. Here are the example how I select two values of t test in which calculated t test value of 2.1875 fall between them in front of degree of freedom which is 24. It is one important tip that is alpha 1 and alpha 2 here means that one side upper tail p value is between 0.01 and 0.025 but we can't get it easily. Now calculated value of probability of t test which is 0.0143 and 0.0207 fall between two levels alpha 1 and alpha 2 and same for two tail test. Thus different methods gives different results of p value due to round up but almost equal to ms excel results. Comparing all p values of t test performed software and by hand calculation from Z and T tables. There are no high differences found when comparing different methods to calculate p-value of t-test. Such as row 1 when compared with row 4 and row 5. Kindly subscribe my YouTube channel Thesis Helper. Thanks for watching.